Of our 60 emergency medical technicians from the National Ambulance Service are currently undergoing training to help equip them with skills and knowledge on the equipment on board the new ambulances uh, to uh, be distributed. Our colleague Ajua Ousu Adubia is at the venue and is joining us uh, live now with some updates. Right, Ajua will be bringing us uh, that uh, report pretty shortly. He, she is actually at uh, the venue where the training is taking place, the emergency medical technicians from the National Ambulance Service. Here, we had about 60 personnel from the various regions, which are the 16 regions here to be trained on how to operate the ambulances. The training is supposed to be in two sessions. The first session is today, and that is supposed to help train these people on just the equipment, the use of the equipment. But next week, there will be another session that will be expected to train personnel on the operation of the ambulances. But as you can see, uh, this is one of the ambulances that we have. And you will see all the necessary equipment that is needed to be able to operate this ambulance. Um, Personnel tell me that there are some things that they didn't have in the old ambulance and that is the patient's monitor which you can see. Um, you also have the fetal monitor uh, which were all not present in the old ambulances. But for these new ones, uh, patients are going to have all these things there to ensure that they have very good emergency medical response. But uh, proud to the training, there was a short ceremony where the Deputy Minister of Health was present, Tina Mensa. Uh, we also had the Minister for Special Development Initiative, that is Hal Kumsen. And there is also a team from the manufacturing company, EMS, also present because they are the ones actually going to train the personnel for uh, today's training, especially. They are the ones going to take charge of it. So uh, we are currently at Gempa. The training is ongoing. And we are hoping that by the end of the training next week, uh, we will have an equipped team to help uh, with medical responses in the country. Ajua Adubia Obusu, Gempa TV3.